Hey friends, it's Lisa. Welcome and thank you for watching another one of my videos. So today I have a... I shouldn't do this. <laughs> I really shouldn't be having this. But if you read the title of this video, you know that it is an Erin Condren haul. So it's not an unboxing because I already unboxed it and I already looked at all the stuff. But uh, I feel like every single time I walk away from this company, it just like drags me back in with something that makes, that like piques my interest and that I want it. And then I order it. And then I have that buyer's remorse of why did I do that to myself? So anyway, um, in this chapter of my Erin Condren purchases, I got sucked in because they said travel items were 20% off. And I like travel, I like items. So I wanted to see what kind of things were the 20% off items. Um, and the first thing that was 25, not 25, but 20% off was this petite journal. And this is uh, their travel journal. And it's always take the scenic route or route. I say route, but I know that's probably not the correct way to say it, just how we say it here in Pennsylvania. But this is actually much larger than I thought it was going to be. And what it is, is it's a journal and it goes through four trips. So you could, in theory, you know, use it up to four times, but it does things like reservations and your packing list, um, places to visit and your itinerary. And then it just breaks down like your daily adventures. So um, it says like, what are you seeing? What are you wearing? What are your reservations, your meals, your favorite moments? And it has like an area to write down all the money you spent. And it goes through that four separate times. And in the very back, there is a pocket, and it came with some stickers. But I liked the idea of this, and um, I'm going to be traveling soon, both professionally and personally. And um, for my personal trip, I feel like this will inspire me to actually do things and book things, because I'm not very good at that. So that's this. And then the other travel thing that I bought is this pad, which is the on-the-go pad, and it's personalized with my name. You can get it to say whatever you want. Uh, and basically, this is a packing list, and it goes through all the different things that you might need in your travel. And I'm gonna guess there's like 20 or 25 pages in here. Now, I currently have the snap-in version of this that snaps in your life planner and you need to use wet erase markers. And I had seen Amanda from Amanda's Favorites, her channel, she was hauling this or she had seen it, she shown it on her Instagram and I actually messaged her saying like, you know they have the kind that you can put in your notebook, your planner, and she was like, oh, I like this because it's pen. And it made me think because I never use the snap-in version because of the fact that I need to use wet erase markers. And I don't bring wet erase markers with me when I travel. So while it's great while I'm home planning, like when I'm leaving the destination and want to make sure I have everything, I don't have those markers. So I think this is going to be really great. And as I just said, I'm going to be traveling professionally and personally. And I just want to make sure that I have everything that I need prior to traveling because I am that person that either packs way too much and people joke, are you moving? You know, why do you need five coats and eight pairs of shoes? I don't know. Or I pack too little and I've gotten to places and I've forgotten whole categories of clothing. Like I've forgotten socks before or like undergarments or I think one time I forgot like all but one pair of pants. Luckily I was at a family's house, um, like a vacation house and so I could just run to Walmart or whatever and buy cheap clothes. It wasn't like I was on a cruise or, you know, really out of luck. Okay, now that that little tangent's over. Um, and then the other thing that I bought that is from their travel selection is this oversized tote. Um, this is in the flamingo print, obviously. And if you've seen... My videos before when I was filming on my couch, you would have seen my flamingo pillows. I've, I have like flamingo art. I don't know why I'm stuck in this like Florida type 
theme, but I, I love flamingos. And so I got the flamingo pattern. I have it also in planner covers and mouse pads and the, the folder thing. But uh, I picked the beat. This colorway is called Beat, B-E-E-T, um, and it's personalized. And it's a canvas bag, and it's huge. It's huge. I don't actually know what I'm going to do with it because I just con marie a whole bunch of my totes because I had way too many bags. But I envision myself if I go traveling or if I go have a pool day or something, I can just throw my stuff in here. And this was also 20% off. Um, so while I was putting stuff in my cart, you know, at Erin Condren, you can get free shipping at $75. Well, I got to $75 and I wasn't getting free shipping and it was boggling my mind. It was to the point where I would leave my order on my computer, go away for a couple hours and then come back and try to figure out what was going on and then walk away for a couple hours. It was like a seven hour order because I just kept walking away from my computer in frustration. What I should have done, and I finally did do, because I was convinced that the site was broken. It's not broken. If I would have read the FAQs earlier on the site, which I finally did, I would have found out that anything textile related, so the tote bags, the Sherpa throws, um, the clothing, the pillows if they still sell them, because they come from a separate warehouse, no matter how much you spend, you're never going to get free shipping because these items always have shipping on them. So I was like playing around and trying to get things. So I kept putting things in my cart and I went through probably like five, six, seven different versions of my shopping cart before I checked out. So while I was putting stuff in my cart, some other things that fell into my cart um, were these well-kept um, what are they called? Screen cleansing towels. I've never had them before, but they work on phones, tablets, computer screens, glasses, and those are all things that I own. So I thought it would be really great. So this is from the two pack that I believe is like 10 or 10.95. What you need to be careful of, if you buy one of these, and then you double it in your cart or you buy one and then one, they charge you $12. You don't get the, the $10. You have to buy it from the actual, you know, dual pack item. So that's important to note. Um, and it's in the mid-century circles packaging, which isn't really important, but whatever. Um, so I'm interested to see how these work out. I also bought a three pack of the metallic mini bookmarks. These are the ones that just snap into your planner. I have kind of like, the, I don't want to be obsessed, but I like having uh, the bookmarks. And I've gotten a couple from Recollections at Michael's, but uh, since I was doing the shopping on Erin Condren's site and I was trying to, you know, figure this whole thing out, I threw them in my cart. Um, and then the then at that point, it was like, oh, you, if you have four accessories, then all of your, uh, all of your accessories are then 15% off. So at that point, I'm like, oh, I don't need any accessories, but I just, I don't know. You know, have you ever been that person that's trying to like figure things out? I was very much like Russell Crowe in A Beautiful Mind, like, formulas were going through my head and I could I feel like if you looked at me you would have seen me really trying to figure out this whole how do I get the best deal uh, with the most items for the least amount of cost so uh, the last two items I got were items that I don't need because I don't need any of this um, but they're more interchangeable covers so the first one that I bought this time is this mid-century circles one and I think this is an adorable pattern. Mid-century circles was the theme three planner cycles ago. So like right now it's Woven Wonders, last year it was Painted Petals, and the year before that, which I think would be 2016 into 2017, would have been mid-century circles. And so I never got the, the cover at that point, and I love it, and I love how the name has the multicolor, and I just feel like it fits my brain vibe that I have. It's just like colorful and whatever. And then the last one, um, the last item of this haul, 
excuse me, is another interchangeable cover and it's also colorful and it also is for fall. And it's this pumpkin interchangeable cover. And I love it. I love the colors, uh, the ombre, they're changing. I love the back background, blah, black background. I love that the, my name is in different colors. I think it's great. So I'm pretty excited about this. So that was my Erin Condren haul. I'm trying to tell myself, girl, don't. Just don't even look at the website. You don't need anything. You got everything you need. You don't need another planner. You don't need accessories. So I'm hoping that this is the last Erin Condren haul that I do until maybe Christmas, but I'm gonna be honest, if I buy more stuff, I'm probably gonna make a video and then hopefully somebody can say, I thought you weren't gonna buy any more stuff. So anyway, if you liked this video or you found any of the information helpful, uh, please think about giving this video a thumbs up. Until next time, I hope you guys all stay well. Bye.